Uh, hey, Payne. Hey, Payne. Uh-huh. Uh, 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 uh. This shit too fly for me to talk on. I'ma shut my ass up and just be a fan. Just be a fan. The sun goes down and the moon comes up. The blunts go round. Everybody getting drunk all night. All night. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Great deal. Pull up and I'm swerving, hopping out, hella clean, park it on the curb and make that fucking Chevy lean. You know I deserve it. I'm gonna have a good time. We gonna have a good time together. Trend set up. Trend Put a bye-bye, goodbye, all that bad shit. Get that out your head, girl. You came here to party. Let's do this instead, girl. I know you deserve it. If you free your mind up, we can have a good time whenever. How can I, I tell ya? What I wanna say, wanna say, without you sending me. Hold my fucking way, fucking way, but I don't mean no harm. A nigga just trying to see what's cracking. You was walking around this party like you don't know what happens when the sun goes down and the moon comes up. The blunts go round, everybody getting drunk all night. You know we put it down, put it down all night. And we gon' fuck around, fuck around. Now everybody's drinking and everybody's smoking. Party on, party on. I'm gonna take this shit going on. I know why you came here. You gon' have a good time. We gon' have a good time together. Get this party started. I'm up in this bitch now. Throwing money in the air. Everybody rich now. Hop up on this couch, girl. If you come and sit down, we can have a good time forever. How can I tell ya? What I wanna do, wanna do. Cause I do anything and everything to you. Thing to you, but I don't mean no harm. Come and get on some of this pappy. You was walking around this party like you don't know what happens when the sun goes down and the moon comes up. The blunts go round, everybody getting drunk all night. You know we put it down, put it down all night. And we gon' fuck around, fuck around. Now everybody drinking and everybody smoking. Party on, party on. I'ma keep this bitch going all night. Hey, what up? We put it down, put it down all night. Adio, push the vibes only. Bad with the baddest head She in the bed doing magic tricks We pass out after passing meds We living on the jagged edge So where the party at? We gon' smoke and spread love Until Bob Marley back And take shots at every bar we at I feel like I gotta borrow Cause these niggas hardly rapping Girl, you know my style I'm price I know you wanna go all night Teddy Pender told me about her type Tell me, girl, you ain't nothing nice huh, You ain't supposed to be out tonight You got work tomorrow, probably got class Got your girls with you, all of them got ass And y'all got it free to sit and look mad Look here, come to my spot, leave your purse and your camera phone No pictures, little mama, leave that alone Tryna get that from the back and the back alone I know that's too full, but damn, I'm on <laughs> Bussin' and shake it, cause you know you ratchet Girl, ain't nobody looking quick, act like, like you don't know what happens when the sun goes down And the moon comes up The blunts go round Everybody getting drunk all night And everybody smoking, party on, party on I'ma keep this bitch going all night You know we put it down, put it down all night And we gon' fuck around, fuck around all night What's good, you two? That one on YouTube, you're back again once again. Today, people, today we're back for episode number 28 of our Pokemon Glaze Nuzlocke. In the last episode, you guys... We made some foolish decisions and we lost a powerful, 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 that's an understatement of monumental proportions. We lost a very powerful member of our team and we did have a grinding montage to go ahead and make up for it. Uh, I don't want to spoil anything else from last episode, so if you missed out on it, definitely make sure you go back and check it out. But we did make it here to Goldenrod City and we're going to we're gonna continue south through Ilex Forest, where apparently smoke is billowing out of. We need to go figure out what the hell Team Fusion, Regina, and the thrown together Team Fusion are doing in Ilex Forest. And then make our way to Azalea Town, where we can hopefully take on Bugsy, and then Simon, I think it said his name is? Uh, apparently, I guess Whitney's not the, the gym leader in Goldenrod anymore? I don't know, Simon doesn't seem so tough now that he's locked in his gym, does he? So, I, I don't know, I guess Whitney... Yo, does that mean that Whitney's one of the Elite Four members? 
Oh shit. Because you remember, guys, they said when Mount Silver erupted, it destroyed the Indigo Plateau, and Johto made their own Pokemon League, and they took the toughest gym leaders from the Johto region and made them Elite Four members. And for a decade, Whitney has always been one of the most ash hole douchebaggery trainers, gym leaders from the Johto region. So, yo, is Whitney now an Elite Four member? Mmm. Either way, if you guys are hyped for today's episode of Pokemon Glaze, and of course, if you're a prime member of that B Nation, make sure you smash that like button down below for us. You guys have been absolutely destroying, demolishing, molly whopping the goals that we have been setting. You guys asked for goals to come back, and I set a goal of 2,500 because that's traditionally what we normally get, but you guys have been obliterating that. Like, it's not even funny. So, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna go out on a limb here. Let's go out on a limb here and see if the Nappy Nation can actually come together. Let's set a like goal of three thousand likes for today's episode i will be honestly sh shit shocked <laughs> if it happens but either way like i did say we did have a grinding montage so let's go ahead and get a quick team recap because some things have changed in our party i decided to get everyone up to level 60 like i said last time we have general so our blaziken here who is holding the charcoal to power up that blaze kick he's also rocking earthquake brick break and slash then we have 40 below our glaceon who's now one of the oldest members in our party that's so Awkward to say. Oh, I feel like Glaceon. Like there was a time when it was like the new one in the team, and now it's just it's it's a veteran. Level 60, holding the Nevermelt Ice to power up that Ice Beam. It's also rocking Water Pulse, Quick Attack, and Shadow Ball. Then we have Zenzibotter, our Don fan, level 60, whose Quick Claw didn't pop in the last episode, but he carries a Quick Claw because he's the slowest member on our team. Earthquake, Rock Smash, Rollout, and Strength. And when the Quick Claw does pop, is nice. He's very, very nice. Then we have Treasure, our Gengar, who's level 60, holding the Twisted Spoon. He's only holding the Twisted Spoon because I didn't have anything else to give him. Legit, that's it. And the Twisted Spoon, I guess, will power up Psychic. But he's also rocking Thunderbolt, Confuse Rate, and Shadow Ball. Like I said, I didn't really have anything else to give him. So, Twisted Spoon it is. Then, uh, the first of our two new team members, we have David the Slowbro. <laughs> Look at that animation. Oh, my head. We have David the Slowbro, who is a powerful, powerful, bold nature. Holding the Mystic Water to power up that surf he's also rocking psychic yawn and moonblast yes you do see moonblast um apparently i scooped up the tm from moonblast sometime i don't know if i bought it in the last episode at the department store or not but a lot of you guys in the comment section last time were asking me to make sure i go get the tm from moonblast get the tm from moonblast only reason i taught him moonblast because no one else in my party could and i guess it's a great counter against dark types which he's weak to so we're gonna rock out with it and see how well it does. Honestly, the only thing I would put in that slot is either Ice Beam or maybe Calm Mind. But besides that, but look at that defense! Look at that defense! It's 170 and the HP! The HP! Yo, what is Zanzibar's defense? He's got higher defense than Zanzibar, and Zanzibar eats up everything! David has come through. A lot of you guys also asked if we could put Britannia, our, our Piplup, aka the Empoleon, in our party as well. Um. A couple of you guys made the argument that you don't really see Empoleon too often in LPs, and you're right, you're correct, you're true, but I have actually used an Empoleon in an LP before, but I've never used a Slowbro before, and my phone's going off now. Why does my phone go off the moment that I start recording? Everybody is silent, everything is quiet until I start recording. But either way, like I said, I, I don't know, I haven't used a Slowbro before, and plus the nature is literally perfect you can't get a better nature slow bro than bulls so i decided we're just gonna rock out with david for now the last release we have soul the septile yes you did hear correctly soul the septile it was powerful level 60 as well uh this was formerly known as zagon but a lot of you guys insisted that we go ahead and re-nickname him in tribute to soul from our blaze black egglock which if you guys missed out on that lp it is greatness embodiment. It's it's my favorite project that we've done on the channel. Definitely make sure you go and check it out. But we have Soul and Septile Years holding the Silk Scarf. Uh, he's rocking Quick Attack, Dragon Claw, Brick Break, and Leaf Blade. I gave him the Silk Scarf because, again, it's kind of sort of like uh, Treasure. I, I didn't have a Miracle Seed. I didn't have anything to give him. So it was either the Black Belt or the Silk Scarf. And I figured boosting the priority move might come in handy over just boosting the regular Brick Break. I, I don't know. Just it's sideways logic. But it is what it is. So either way, we got our team back up and running. We're all level 60. And... And surprisingly enough, level 60 is barely on par <laughs> with what we're fighting right now. Um, a lot of you guys asked if I could buy these eggs as well. 
and you guys reason the same thing as like the Eevee argument because they're technically static encounters they're here they're available to purchase it's kind of sort of along the same lines as the fossils you guys remember way back in Gemini Town um, so I did buy one of each even though apparently they respawn you can buy as many as you want I did buy one of each and they're actually chilling on the PC right here because as I was doing grinding I was just grinding against the evolutions and I went to the Olive Mine Lighthouse Challenge they got niggas in there level 67 that shit was scary as a motherfucker I only did that once, went right back to grind them Eevees in Darkwood Town, <laughs> Eevees, Evolutions. Um, so one of these days, I'm going to go ahead and get around to hatching those eggs. Some of you guys are saying that they're pseudo starters like Bagon, Larvitar, Dratini. Other of you guys say it's completely randomized, you don't know what you're going to get from the eggs. So, I don't know, it is what it is, we'll figure it out one of these days. But either way, we need to continue south here. These were the niggas that cost us. <sighs> I'm not even going to think about it. Positive thought. Holy shit! <laughs> I was gonna say positive thoughts, but the place is lit up! Yo, that's what that smoke was. Oh, I get it. I was thinking about that in the last episode. It got all smoky. Because there's fucking fire. Fire! Fire! Let's go ahead and put David up front so we can use a new team member here as. Oh! I, I didn't realize we can get. Okay. And as soon as I put David up front, we get something that he's weak to. All right. I'm going to go for a yawn and put his bitch ass to sleep. Uh, uh. Put his bitch ass to sleep. Uh, uh. I put his bitch ass to sleep. Uh, uh. I was going to say, a rock smash should definitely not kill a fucking Beedrill. Hey, no, no. Stay asleep, bitch. You're locked in a rage? Okay. David. David, come on back out here, please. David, I need David to come back out, please. So I can chuck the great ball. Hey, we call the bee drill. It's female, so I can't name it Shino. A bee drill is extremely territorial. For safety reasons, no one should ever approach his nest. If angered, it will attack in a swarm. Yo, I hate bugs. I hate insects. I especially don't like bees. So if I ever saw a three foot tall bee coming towards me, Peace, nigga, peace, I'm gone. I am out that bitch. You are on your own. It was like I was never there. But because it is female, we have to give it the uh, standard nickname of Savage. Because that works, and it still relates back to Shino. If it was male, I would have nicknamed it Shino. But apparently we can run into wild Pokemon in this goddamn forest. So you know what? This one super pill is going to come in fucking handy if it's the last thing I do. It's the last thing I... Ooh, hello, Samurott. I'm gonna need you to stop what you're doing. Nice and swords dance for a water pulse. I'll see you be down. 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 So I don't know what the hell. Are they trying to like burn out? Because I mean, Ilex Forest has always been like, that's Celebi, right? That's where Celebi's chilling at. Yo, can I touch the fire? Fire is too hot to cross. So I need an HM to cross the fire. <laughs> Yo, I have Surf. I should be able to cross the fire with Surf. I still can't believe that they just straight up lit the entire forest up. That's some crazy psychotic shit. Yo, that's insane. Catch this surf. Yo, David is putting in the finest of work, nigga. I love it, I love it, I love it. Clefable? The fuck? Let's go out to Zanzibar. Clefable's always one of those Pokemon I'm just, I look at it, I'm just like, what do you do? And like, I know, like, I have Barbara, so like, I kind of sort of know what Clefable does, but at the same time, I'm just looking at it like, I feel like you're about to take my life any moment. I can't get that item. Shit. I feel like we're going to have to come back. Because this is taking us straight back to the front. Straight back to Azalea Town. Oh, look at the little dog fan. It's going to die. Like I said, we're barely on par at being at level 60. Well, David 61, goddammit. David 61, goddammit. Oh, wait, can I go around? Ooh, wait, she didn't battle me. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> she didn't battle me, and then she does. <laughs> okay, then. Catch that. Vaporeon? Vaporeon? Yo, soul come through, nigga. Soul come through, nigga. Soul come through, nigga. Soul has been revived. Soul has been revived through Pokemon Glazed. Ooh, I love it, I love it, I love it. Look at the flick of the wrist. Okay, uh, let me see here. You know, I was thinking while I was grinding that since we ended up here in Johto again, and this is like, it's like a third gen Johto, Okay, so that's apparently where this shit's going down at. So hold on, before we get over there, I want to see what this guy has to say. Burn! Burn for us! Burn! Okay. Let's stay away from him. 
I was thinking that since it's a third gen Johto, this is like a better version of Liquid Crystal. Let me stop, I'm being mean. Like, I don't know who the hell you are, but stop this right now. <laughs> Two gym leaders. Oh wait, that's the wrong voice. I was sitting there thinking I wanted to do Jesse's voice from Ash Gray, but I just realized I don't do a voice for Jesse and Ash Gray. I just do James for both Team Rocket members. So I, I need like, like I know the voice that I've had for her before, but I want to give her like a devious voice, like an evil team leader voice. Oh, you know what? You know what? You know what? No, she's gonna have Lyra's voice. If you guys remember Lyra from a long, long time ago. <laughs> Two gym leaders and a kid are gonna stop me? That's cute! Yo, she's lighting up. Come on, you stupid fairy! Save your fucking forest! Oh, this is me. Superman and this bitch. N that's enough, Regina! Innocent people are getting hurt. The silent hero speaks! If you want me to quit, why don't you just come and stop me? Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Fusion boss Regina. She's got a Zobra Wark. David, this is not a good matchup for you, David. Let's get you out of here, David. It's okay, David. It's okay, David. Ooh. Ooh. Torment? Ooh, so I can't use the same move twice? How about a brick break, nigga? Ah, uh, ah. Uh. How about a brick break, nigga? Ah, uh, ah. Uh. How about a brick break, nigga? Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Yo, I should actually give General So the black belt, because I end up using him more so for fighting type moves than, well, for brick break, I should say, than anything else. A ditto? Yo, ditto's a normal type. Oh, I can't use the same move twice! Shit! We'll catch this blaze kick. Will it be enough? There we go. Okay. Ditto's got shit stats anyway, so. I was gonna say, I can't. I brick break his bitch ass before he can uh, transform into me or anything like that. But you know what? I can brick break this nigga right here! He's a normal type nigga! Catch this brick break! That was a crit too. Oh my god. I do apologize. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. And Ag ooh, Agron, I, I would stay, well no, I can't stay, I was gonna say, I would stay in and Brick Break him again, because it's four times effective when it's stabbed, but I can't, because of Torment, but I can hit you with this four times effective, Ikudo! Yo, Regina has a different time, every single time, with a different time, a different team, every single time we battle her, and it's always so random, like, Zoroark's the only one I remember, like, she got a fucking Agron, a Zoroark, a Kecleon, a Bayonet, where the fuck she get the Bayonet from? Like, nigga, Shadow Ball. Cheshire come through for the W. I said Cheshire come through for the W. I said Cheshire come through. Cheshire come through. Cheshire Cheshire come through for the W. I'm in a good mood tonight, okay? Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Drat! I know, right? I know, right? I know, right? Oh! Oh! You hear that? You're too late! Come on, Celebi! Oh. What have you done to my beautiful forest? Who is responsible for this? You know what I want, Celebi! I know you have the Aurora Orb! Give it to me! And we'll leave your precious forest! The Aurora Orb? I... I don't know what you're talking about. I don't have any sort of orb. You lying bitch! Burn the forest to the ground! Regina... Regina! Please don't hurt Celebi! Stop it! Last chance, Celebi! Give me what I want now, or else say goodbye to your precious forest, bitch! Bree! <laughs> oh shit! What? How? I've heard Celebi could time travel, but I didn't know it was true. At last, the Aurora Orb! Oh god. Celebi, take us back now, bitch! And the forest will be left in peace? I have no need to burn the forest anymore! I've got what I need! Take us back now, bitch! I like how Regina says bitch, I'm sorry. <laughs> Wait, like, oh my god, like, what just happened? Like, you vanished for maybe a second. Like, I blinked my eyes, and I got some ash in them, and then I opened them, and I still had the ash in my eyes from the burning forest. Not ash from the anime. Get your mind out of the gutter. Oh my god. How could you take advantage of Celebi like that? It didn't deserve any of this. <laughs> Our plan is nearly complete. You may have won our battle. Our little battle, but Team Fusion wins in the end! We're done here! Ta-ta, Nappy! Oh, God. Who the hell is this nigga? Pardon not me for eavesdropping, but did you mention Celebi? Or should it be Celebri? Uh, I... Who are you? I'm a sergeant, you did. Please, come with me, you must. 
It must be Arceus' will. Knocked out, you fly! Wait, I... Why are you scoop up just those two and not us? Oh my god, like, that was crazy! Like, that guy, do you know him? Pius? Like a Prius? Like, I drive a Prius to Starbucks every single day! Ha! <laughs> well, he gives me the creeps. Hopefully he'll be back quick. Jasmine hates being with strangers. I guess there's nothing else we can do here. Oh, oh my god, I know. You must come to the gym with me. Come on, like, hurry up. Yo, I like how Jasmine just gets abducted by some strange old guy. I was going to say, can I type Can I type the, whatchamacallit? Can I type something into there and get a syllabi? Like, Jasmine just gets scooped up by some strange old Asian man. And Whitney does not give two fucks. She's just like, I hope she's back soon. Totally. That's what that bitch gets for being flirty. Whatever. So wait, can we? She she has to go to her gym. Should we go to her gym first, or should we explore down here first? Yo, the episode that we add David to the party, all of these little niggas is around. I don't know what I should do. I mean, we're in the rain, and this nigga's gonna have. There we go. I was gonna say we're in the rain. Get out. Get out, bruh. Get out. I think I'm gonna go ahead and get my uh, Union Cave kind of right now. I don't know, like, I was gonna say- Oh, wait, I have a repel up. Shit! I'm not wasting it. We'll come back. We never got the Union Cave. That never happened. You didn't see that. We hold the Slowpoke here in very high regard. Please don't battle or try to capture any- Really? We can battle and capture them? Okay, I'm gonna leave Azalea Town untouched for now because she asked us- Shit, now the repel wore off. Fuck! Do I go back and get my encounters now or just- We're gonna continue. She asked us to go to the gym, so we're gonna go to the gym and then we'll come back and battle uh, Bugsy, whoever the gym leader in Azalea Town is. Cause those are the only two gyms that were messing with my head the entire time anyways. Like, like, like you guys know I have the obsessive compulsive and you gotta do shit in the right order all the time. And it's like, it's okay, oh we got charcoal, I guess that makes sense you get a charcoal here. Like, it's, it's cool and it's okay for you to like, uh, skip one or two gyms, but then we like, we went from first to fourth. Then we did the fifth gym as well. No we didn't. We did the sixth gym, because technically, whatchamacallit is the fifth gym, Chuck. But Chuck's not a gym leader anymore. Ah, let's Moonblast see how much we can do. Hey, Moonblast! Moonblast putting in work. It's just, stop with the double protect! Triple protect! Oh my god! What? I, I think I've seen triple protect like three times, no pun intended, like three times in my entire life, and that was one of them. Somebody left a comment on an episode saying, we're gonna do this again. So they have to come out on an episode saying that um, apparently if Oh really? We have to do this again. That was too soon. That was too that was way too soon. I'm sorry. That was too soon. That was just too soon. I'm gonna I'm gonna try and skip these trainings. We don't well I, you know what? No, I take that back. I'm gonna battle them right now. Since we're here, I'm gonna battle them right now. Moonblast, Parish Song. Uh, how about you catch a Moonblast and get me the fuck out of here before this Parachong bullshit goes down. Before all this Parachong bullshit goes down. Skip Plume? Uh, I don't trust it. I don't trust it. You never trust a Skip Plume. Never trust a Skip Plume. Hashtag never trust Skip Plume in the comments. Oh, don't even get me started on a fucking Jump Bluff. That sneaky little... Mm, 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 mm. Oh, this nigga. Oh, you gonna have- Oh, sweet! Don't tell me Simon has fighting types. Don't tell me Simon has fighting types. Do you need help with Simon? I'll give you a hint. Fighting types are super effective to normal type- Oh, so no, 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 so he doesn't have fighting types. He's still a normal type trainer, just like Whitney. Oh, I see you, big dog. I see you, big dog. Well, if that's the case, then we should be good to just do this. And you know what? I'm going to do what I was talking about the whole time. I'm going to give him JK. It's in the PC. I had to get rid of the items in my bag because I was starting to have too much, too much shit in there. Let's scoop this up. And let's go ahead. I can leave the shark hole there because we just scooped up another one. So it's not taking up any additional space than what I already had before. So now, like, I want to go and talk to everybody here now since, like, Goldenrod City is no longer under siege or hostage or anything. Like, I want to talk to everybody and see if they want to give me anything. Wait, no, this isn't Bill's house. Bill? Billy Willie? 
He don't want to give me shit. Fuck him and his mother or his daughter or his nephew, whoever that was, just sitting there. Nobody's down here anymore. It's all the same people that were here before. They're just people are outside now. Name Raider. So there's that's the name. Well, I knew that was the name Raider. This chick ain't got shit to say. <laughs> she ain't got nothing to say. But still, like, I want to go around and talk to everybody and see what they got for me. Route 34 is a daycare for Pokemon. If you leave Pokemon there, it might increase. Oh, we can speak to Pokemon in this game. I forget that all the time. Very scary things happen in the daycare when you leave two Pokemon. Very scary. Like butt sex. Wait, let me stop. Wait, let me stop. Wait, let me stop. Going around flower shop? Damn, this is a depressing place now. This is a depressing place. I'm trying my hardest to, like, go and speak to everybody as quickly as I can. Wait, what's the trade building? I hear they have lots of trainers eager to trade there. So there's a trade building. It's a mudkip. The fuck am I supposed to know that? It's a Zorark. It's not, they don't even give me the option for Zorark, you ass. Whatever. I'm just looking for people to give me shit. I'm just looking for people to give me shit. And then I actually want to check. Ooh. Yo, there hasn't been a bike in this game yet. The door's been locked tight. What the fuck? Oh, the Johto bike shop's closed. Well, I mean, I guess this game happens after Johto. Or after the events of 2nd Gen. Nobody comes his way to or from Kanto anymore. It's all very disheartening. Does it mean it's closed? Oh, look, boy's back! I'm the creator of this hack, and I decided to come into my game and give some trivia about the game. Would you like to listen? Sure. Golden Rod City was one of the more challenging cities to create. There are many different types of buildings I needed, and a tile set only holds so much. I ended up running out of pallets, which is why the gatehouses are colored differently. I think it was ultimately worth it. The gatehouses look pretty nice in their new color anyway. What do you mean, something else? No, you're just okay. Okay, luck boy. Luck boy. Calm down. Calm down, luck boy. Can you take us there? The Magnet Train isn't making trips to Kanto. A large portion of the line is being blocked by debris from the recent eruption. So Kanto, they just, ooh, they just shut it down. Shut that shit down, 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 down. Wait, we're having a promotion today. Answer five questions correctly and we'll award you with the radio app for the Poke Gear. Oh, you don't have a Poke Gear? What a shame. No. A few years ago, Team Rocket, Team, Team Rocket, Team Rocket broke into this wonderful radio tower. The, the recent takeover by Team Fusion only brought back those bad memories. Following recent incidents, we have closed up the upper floors of the radio tower. So, like, everything that you know about Johto, like, is just all, like, up, upside down. Turn this bitch upside down. It looks like there's an island on the horizon, but I've never seen it before. What? I think my old eyes are up to their tricks again. It looks like there's an island on the horizon, but I've never seen it before. Hold on. Hold on. There's an island on the horizon that she's never seen before. World Islands. Reef and Isle. New Island. Oh, uh, Oaken Island. Wait, isn't New Island the whole Mewtwo thing? Colo Isle, Nitro Isle, Alpha Isle, Rain Isle. Yeah, apparently everybody was saying that this is the third region that's like in the middle of the game because Glaze is known for having three regions. So you have Tuna, which we already did, Johto, what we're going through now, and then there's. Uh, I don't remember the name. Somebody left a name in the comment section before, but. Oh well, we'll get to it when we get to it. But New Island, wasn't that the Mewtwo thing from the movie? I don't remember. I think it was. I think it was where Nurse Joy was telling everyone. We got a coin case. We got a motherfucking coin case. And do they have anything decent for sale here? Like a Dratini, maybe? Oh, they have roulette! Ooh. We have no more room for Pokemon. Ooh. So even though I don't have room for Pokemon, I can't see what prizes I get? You're an ass. Fuck you. And your mother. Anyways, let me go down here and check out this trade building real quick. Hello, hello! Welcome to the trade building! I created this place so trainers around the world may trade Pokemon! Please enjoy yourself here! So, like... So, like, is the trade... Is it gonna be, like... Exactly, that's what I was about to say. Is it gonna just gonna be, like, a whole bunch of people that have, like, static trades for you? Does it change every single day? Because, like, I'm playing on an emulator, obviously, so unless I did a whole bunch of hijink shit, I can't actually connect with other people. So, it's, uh... My Machoke for your Magikargo, so that's how you get him a champ in-game. 
Oh, hello, is that Oak? There's so many different kinds of people here. While I love the diversity, I just can't understand the many different languages. Hola, quieres cambiar tu handum por mi graveler? No, I'm good. Oh, si quieres cambiar después, voy a estar aquí. I'm sorry, bro. Golem is not in the in in my future right now. Professor Oak is amazing. Did you know he has his own radio show? Yes. Bonjour, mon ami. Voulez-vous exchanger que diries? I can't speak French. Oh, wait, wait, wait. What did he say? Oh, so that's how you're gonna Alexander. Oh. I was waiting for the event to be released. I want to be the first one to get it. Wait, they have events up here? Some Pokemon can only be found by events. You can pick them up here. Are there any events running yet? But don't worry, there will be soon. Ooh. So they have event Pokemon in here too. What up, Oak? Oh my, if it isn't Nappy. Do you remember me? I'm Professor Oak. I was just doing a seminar to these fine young men and women on the Kanto region. Say, this gives me a grand idea. Would you like a Kanto... A Kanto starter. Splendid! Just choose any of the three Pokeballs in front of me. Don't worry, I won't judge. Huh. Huh. Hmm. I don't know which one I should choose. I'm actually really hesitant. We don't need a fire type. We got a water type. This whole game has been nothing but starters, you guys realize that. A lot of ROM hacks end up like that. They end up giving you just multiple options for starters and whatnot. Because, like, they gave us a Mudkip at the beginning of the game. Then we got a Piplup, Wild Piplup. Uh, then I got a Blaziken they gave to us. A Quilava they gave to us. A uh, fucking, fucking Grovile they gave to us. And they're going to give us these three starters as well. So, And I, d I realized when we were grinding, four of the six Pokemon on our team can Mega Evolve in 6th Gen. Ain't that a bitch? Uh, I don't know who I really want to take. Like, Charizard is nice because Fire Flying is a great typing. Blastoise is awesome. I love him as well. But then there's Grass Poison Venusaur, which I would love to scoop up as well. You know what? No, no, no. I'm going to scoop up Charmander because in all of my Let's Plays, I always end up choosing either Squirtle or Bulbasaur. So this time, I'm going to be different, different for myself. Because I know Charmander is probably the most popular one of them all. But I always end up... Cho cho oh, we don't have enough fucking room. God damn it. I always end up choosing one of the other two just because I'm a hipster like that. So this time around, I'm going to choose Charmander. Or should I not? Should I not choose Charmander because... Oh, we got a Totodile as well. I forgot about that. Should I not choose him? Because we have... No, I guess we only have those two fire types and Victini there as well. I'm going to choose Charmander. I'm going to choose Charmander. I'm going to be that guy, and I'm going to scoop up Charmander. We got a Charmander. Give a nickname to Charmander. Uh, I'm going to nickname him... Uh, What should I nickname Charmander? If it's a Charizard X, I name it Acnologia. But there is no Charizard X in this game. So I'm kind of sort of tempted to name it just Natsu. I don't know, like, that's just, that's just super... Cause I don't think I don't think I've used a Charizard in a Let's Play since our Platinum Egglock. Oh my! I completely lost track of the time. I need to get to the radio station. Sorry we couldn't chat longer. See you around, Nappy. And he took the fucking Pokeballs with him. You ass. Yeah, I don't think I've used a Charizard in a long time. I'm telling you, I, I know I've used plenty of Bulbasaur's and plenty of uh, Blastoises as well. Like I went from the starter to the final form. Oh okay, yeah, so let's go ahead and check them out. Jolly Nature is actually really good for Savage. Rage Pursuit, Pin Missile, and Agility. Then we have Natsu, who's Naive, which I think makes a mixed Charizard. So, I mean, we could run Flamethrower and... Yeah, because I think Naive up speed and lowers special defense. So, we could run Flamethrower and Earthquake together. So, that's actually not bad. That's actually really not bad. We're going to go ahead and scoop uh, Soul up and put him in the party. Put him in the party. Put him in the... Put him in the... Put him, put him in the coffin. So, we'll be back, Mr. Trade Man, to check any sort of uh, events you might have going on there. But I think we explored everything else here. So now I think it's time for us to do what we came here for. And that is to take on the Golden Rod City Gym. Let's see what we got, bruh. Uh, Whitney, uh, I, 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 I mean, Simon trains the normal type. You know what to do, don't you? Oh, well, fuck you. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Oh, really? Wait, Clefairies? That Clefairy ate that shit up. And the Brick Break just shatters it. Oh, my God. Let's go. Yo, why is this? No, 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 no,
Clefable? Uh, I'm not liking... Oh, wait, Clefable's a fairy type, isn't it? In this game. Clefairy is a fairy type in this game. I mean, Clefable is a fairy type in this game. That's why Brick Break wasn't doing shit. Is it normal fairy? I thought they made it just completely 100% fairy. Oh, shit. That's... That's home... Uh, can I... Can, hello? No? Okay. I'll just, I'll just go, I'll just go bully these other trainers real quick. Brick break, get the fuck out of here, bruh. You got two Earth Rings? Because killing one wasn't enough, was it? Was it? Was it? Yo, but look at this, they have fucking Earth Rings in this gym. Like, goddamn. You out to just kill me? The hell? I think I'm going to, since it's a normal type gym, I'm going to leave with, or I'm going to treasure up here for this double battle. Treasure's actually not a bad, oh, hello. Treasure's actually not a bad thing to go out to. Um, I'm going to get the uh, psychic off on you. Play rough. Ooh, you have play rough. Ooh, you have play rough. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't. I don't like it. Sin, you gonna put treasure to sleep? How about you catch this motherfucking psychic, bitch? You getting psychic from all different angles, all different types, all different kinds of people is hitting you with them psychics, nigga. Uh, uh, no, that's the wrong normal type. That's the wrong normal type. I wasn't trying to mess with that normal type. <laughs> but yo, these trainers at level 57s. Our party's level 60. And these niggas have level 57s. Hey yo, being a normal type gym, having all these birds, that's cheating. That's taking advantage of the system a little bit, don't you think? Okay, so before we head there, I actually want to go back and uh, heal up and get our PP back. Before we take on Simon real quick, like, uh, just, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Excuse me. I think that's a little bit taking uh, taking advantage of the system. The notion that oh, like, well, I mean, I guess, I guess, I mean, I guess, if anything, all those birds secondary typing is flying. So all flying type juniors from here on out should just have a thunderous on their team, or no, a tornadus. My bad. They should have only tornadus on their team because that's the only primary flying type Pokemon. It's the only uh, flying type Pokemon by itself. I was gonna say primary type. Well, I guess primary type would be the right thing to call it. Because it's, it's, it's single type, it's mono type, it's not dual type or anything. But either way, we're going to save our game right here because only you can prevent Law Save Daddy. You guys know that, you guys know that, you guys know that. Let's go ahead and do this. Oh my god, like, I love you too, my little cutie. Oh my god, oh, Nappy, I wasn't expecting you so soon. <laughs> this little cutie is my Simon. Like, isn't he just the sweetest? He's the gym leader now, not to mention my boyfriend. I'm sorry, but I can't stay and watch your battle. I gotta get back to the league. I told you it was Whitney. Say me, why me? Bye bye. And like you too, Nappy. Yo, watch this nigga be like, I'm so sick and tired of her. I can't stand her. Oh no, never mind. Oh, my little Whitney Pie. Isn't she just the best a guy could ask for? You should just hear the way she giggles. Oh, oh, you were here for a gym battle, weren't you? Don't think I'm a bleeding heart. Behind my fluttering heart lies a tough guy. Let's battle. That's the James voice. He gets the James voice. Okay, Simon. Please don't have like level 65s. A Clefable. Shit. I can't do anything with General So. I can't do anything. Uh, uh, uh. If I had Sludge Bomb on Gengar, that'd be perfect. Thunder Wave. Uh, huh, lol, lol, lol. Let's not. Let's let's not. Meteor Mash. Oh my God. And of course you get. You know what? You need to stop. You need to stop all this. What you're doing right? Excuse me. You need to stop. Right now. You need to. Stop this nonsense! Please hurt yourself! What is happening? 
we lose Tsunami in the last episode, and now Treasure! Our Gengar is gone! Oh no! <laughs> Belly Drum Meteor Mash Clefable! What? I'm so in disbelief right now. Like, I want to scream at the top of my lungs, but I'm just like, did that just happen? Who does that? What? I should have gone out to Don, fam. I'm. So, I. I feel like it hasn't set in on me yet. I feel like that's what that's what's happening right now. I feel like it just hasn't set in on me yet. I feel like it just hasn't set on me yet. We just lost Gengar. <laughs> we just lost Cheshire! This blizzy. <sighs> I don't want to play this game anymore. I don't want to play this game anymore. I don't want to play this game anymore. I should have swapped out. I should have fucking swapped out. I should have swapped out. I should have swapped out. I should have swapped out. <laughs> If it wasn't 10.30 at night right now, I would absolutely be screaming at the top of my lungs. Because now it's setting in on me. Now it's setting in on me. Now it's fucking setting in on me and I'm pissed. I want to get out of this fucking gym. I want this Tauros to stop double-edging me like the fucking cunt that he is. Stop. Like Jesus Christ. I just risked a crit kill right there. A spinda. Nigga. A spinda. You're a fucking gym leader. Get this fucking piece of shit out of here. Toga kiss. Oh, guess who has Thunderbolt? Guess who has Thunderbolt? <sighs> Fire blast. Can Thick Fat come through? Oh, thank you. Do we have speed? Get off my fucking screen. <sighs> you know, there was a, a part of me, there was a part of me that was like, let's just save the gym for the next episode. And... I was like, nah, 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 nah. We didn't, we didn't do a whole lot in this episode. Let's go ahead and take on the gym right now. Fuck his voice. I don't care right now. Attract. You give me a tract of all things you could have possibly given me. You give me a tract, dude. I look like Mo. I don't fucking care about a tract. Oh my. God. <laughs> Belly Drum Meteor Mash Clefable that breaks through confusion is what takes down Cheshire.
I don't even know what I want to replace treasure with on my team. I should just go with that unknown. That's how I feel right now. I feel like an unknown. <laughs> I mean, we have firefighting, we have ground, we have ice, we have water psychic, we have grass. Honestly, what we're missing is electric or another ghost type. The only other ghost type we have though is Krona. Or I'm really not interested in using Krona right now. So, electric, everyone wants me to use the Pikachu. But Pikachu is booty, let's be real. Pikachu is complete and utter ass. Um, I was thinking about adding Pidgey to the team, but that would just make another electric weakness, another ice weakness, another ice weakness with soul as well. What about Lacey? I think I'm gonna add Lacey to the team. Fuck it. Why not? Why not? Why not? Why not? I, I'm just not a huge fan of Pikachu. Like, I know it's the Red Scarf Pikachu and everybody wants me to use it, but I feel like that's so cliche, even if we do end up using it, because it's like, it's the mask out of the fucking game. Well, it's not the mask out, but you know what I mean. I don't know, I'm just... I'm not doing grinding for Lacey. I just did so much grinding. I feel like I should do grinding for Lacey. I'm just gonna give you the experience share for now. What's your moveset? Milk drink, body, roll out, body slam. We need to fix you up real quick. Let me do this while I'm thinking about it. Where is where is it at? Where is it at? Earthquake. Learn this up, Lazy. Learn this up. Get rid of bide. You're not gonna fucking bide on anybody. What else can I teach you? We don't need rock smash, we don't need strength. Your strength would actually be really good on Lacey. Because that's stab. That would actually be kinda decent on Lacey. We're not using milk drink. Because it's counterproductive in a nuzlocke. Oh, wait, 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 do we need strength? I didn't even think about that, because we have body slam. Strength is 80, body slam is 85. We don't technically need strength. I mean, it's better than having a milk drink, so, I mean, if worse comes to worse, we need to get rid of a move, we can get rid of strength or something else. Rollout, I'm actually kind of decent with having right now. If we had Thunder Wave, I'd teach it to him. Is there a team for Thunder Wave anyway? I, like, I don't even care right now, I'm just so... I should teach you Brick Break. That's be like three Pokemon in the party with Brick Break, though. I think Brick Break is actually run on competitive mill tank. I should go find the move tutor and get rid of strength and give it Brick Break instead. <sighs> well, you guys. With that, we're going to go ahead and wrap up today's episode. I hope that you guys enjoyed. If you did, and if you're a proud member of the Nappy Nation, make sure you smash the like button down below for us, because you already know your support is greatly appreciated. But with that, I'm going to get up out of here. Remember, our like goal for today's episode is a powerful 3,000 likes! My game goes Thank you guys so much for watching, and thank you for checking out the video. You know me, 2.92. I'm out.